This is Robert Stromberg. Hi, Robert. Thank you so very much for joining us here in Dallas, Texas. Great. Nice to be with you. Well, I want to let my listening audience know that Robert Stromberg most recently directed Angelina Jolie in Maleficent, which I enjoyed very much. Thank you. And he's also known for his work on The Hunger Games, The Gold Games, The Golden Compass, Games of Thrones, Pirates of the Caribbean. He is a two-time Academy Award winner for Best Achievement and Art Director for Avatar and Alice in Wonderland. How's that resume working for you, Robert? <laughs> uh, you know, I'm still working on uh, building that resume. Yeah, well, you got a long way to go. Yeah, yeah. You've done some exceptional film, and I loved Mal Maleficent. Thank you. I just love the beauty of it. I love the story of it. I love that Angelina Jolie wasn't all that mean. I really love that part. <laughs> <laughs> did you have a great time working on that? I did, yeah. We, uh, you know, uh, I had a great collaboration with Angelina, and, um, you know, uh, we, we spent a lot of time together. I got to know her very well, and she's, you know, super smart, super pro professional, and um, it, was, it was a great experience for me. Well, that's resume building, see? Look, yeah. you got that story, too. Let me ask you, now that you've got these things, on, these little things under your belt, I heard you're doing something with sketches. Well, we're doing a, uh, you know, we're combining, uh, we're making a, a social film, which, which, which means that we're combining sort of the, the efforts of, uh, the, the, uh, of a Hollywood-type production with, you know, uh, Dell, Intel, and uh, their product. And, um, and, and the, the, the audience can now participate. So what, what that means is that uh, what we're doing is reaching out to uh, people to send in their Whatever sketch you know they, they, that comes from within them, some character design that we are going to take and uh, you know through s visual effects and other things take it to uh, other levels of the sort of levels of uh, of a real Hollywood film and I think that's exciting not only for for me as a filmmaker to sort of engage with uh, the people that watch the the final product but um, you know, it's, it's just, uh, it's just, it's, it's unique, and um, I, I think a great opportunity for those to find their own creativity. This is related to what lives inside. That's right. Okay, this is a, a film. Let me ask you: um, Is there any age limit, uh, high or low? No. As a matter of fact, you know, I love the the the, the younger uh, sketches. You know, uh, the, the, because it's just, it's just, you know, raw creativity. It's it's what they feel, and so we're looking at all levels of creativity. But um, there is no age limit. If you can, if you can pick up a, uh, a pen or pencil, then then you qualify. I like that. So they're encouraged to create a character from for what lives inside and submit this sketch or three, up to three, and send it. And you're going to make the you and your team will make the judgment on who's in and who's out. <laughs> That's right. We're we're getting you know thousands of sketches in and. Um, you know, we have a team of people that, that go through these things, and, and, but I will ultimately, and I am, uh, picking the, the sort of final, you know, uh, pieces that will go into the film, um, which will be quite a few. Uh, and, and, and it's really fun for me to, to just to, to see people's effort and to see creativity uh, living and breathing out there. When they de develop the sketches, and say you choose them, uh, do they get, like, screen title credit? Well, uh, yes, we're, we're looking into, you know, how to identify those and, and make, in, in some special ways, recognize those people. Um, and, and the, but the, the, the overall, the, the real glory in it for anybody aspiring to be create, creative is to see their, their, something come from their own mind and to see that in uh, a, a finished, rendered, fully, uh, you know, uh, uh, a Hollywood type film and I think that there's the satisfaction of that and then the the uh, the, the credit as well well also too in creating <coughs> excuse me a sketch for something that Colin Hanks is in the movie that's really uh, a big deal for us regular people to be able to ascend to something or even connect with something like that you know I heard how finally you spoke of working with Angelina Jolie it mm -hmm. would be the same for the person getting the sketch you know, they got, they got a chance to work with Robert Stromberg, and he looked at my drawing. I think just looking at the drawing will thrill many people, you know, yeah. even if they don't win. Well, it, it, I, I love that part of it. I love the, the social interaction um, and working with uh, Dell Intel. 
and uh, their, their Dell tablet, which I have one right here. So the, the, actually the Dell tablet is really important to the storytelling as well because it's interwoven into the storyline. And you know, Colin's character um, actually uses this as a tool to help him find his own creativity. So we're, we're blending a lot of things together, and I think that's what makes it interesting for myself. Great. So Dell will be a key player in a sense in, in the main character, and we, that's what we're seeing. You know, for a long time, it was cars that were uh, um, product placements in mm -hmm. movies. And now we are doing tablets and phones. They, they, take, they play a key role in what we're watching. Well, that was, that was part of the interesting, you know, uh, the, the interesting thing for me was how to not make it feel like an uh, extended commercial, how to um, sort of weave it into a story so it felt natural. And, um, and I think we did that. You have done some great, great movies, uh, and you're working on this one. Have you, you seen the industry? I know you've seen it change. It, it's changed quite a bit. Absolutely. Um, you know, I, I started in this business before there were computers at all. So, so, so I've, I've, I've gone the, uh, down the entire path to where we are now, which, which is amazing. And that's also um, part of the thrill I get out of things, you know, with, films like Avatar and other things that's always been the leading edge of technology <clears throat> and and I find that sort of pioneering aspect of filmmaking really intriguing um, and really an important part of why I want to do this. Where can my audience go so that they can participate? I want them to know how they can participate. Yeah, absolutely. Um, you, you can go to what lives, what lives inside .com, um or we're you know, available on Facebook. You can find us there. Um, or hashtag what lives inside or hashtag um, inside films. That's a great way to get to you. Robert Strongberg, thank you so very much for telling us about this opportunity. I love to offer my audience an opportunity to be better than they are. And thank you for being on the Valder Beebe Show. It was my pleasure. My pleasure. Thank you very much.